On November 18, 1985, Joe Theismann was tackled by Lawrence Taylor and Harry Carson, which resulted in a broken right leg. See, but he knows he's in trouble. Lawrence Taylor, number 56, right there. Carson is number 53. But it's Taylor over Carson. Oh, oh slamming. Oh. And you see the oh. right knee, the right... 33 years later, on November 18, 2018, Alex Smith was tackled by J.J. Watt and Kareem Jackson, which resulted in a broken right leg. Unfortunately, I've got what looks like very bad news for the Washington Redskins. Alex Smith suffers a pretty, oh, it's a gruesome leg injury. You're going to see a replay. Look away. It is a graphic injury. It looks like Alex Smith has broken his leg in the city where Joe Theismann's terrible injury, oh boy. Other than the strange coincidence of these two rare injuries happening on the same day, 33 years apart, there have been quite a few other coincidences found. Joe Theismann was at the game when Alex Smith broke his leg. Both quarterbacks were playing for the Redskins when their legs were broken. Both quarterbacks broke their right tibia and fibula. Both breaks happened in Washington. Both games ended in the same score, 23 to 21. Both injuries happened near the 40 yard line. Lawrence Taylor and JJ Watt are the only two people to win Defensive Player of the Year three times. Taylor tackled Theismann and Watt tackled Smith. On the day of Joe Theismann's injury, his Pro Bowl left tackle Joe Jacoby was not on the field due to injury. On the day of Alex Smith's injury, his Pro Bowl left tackle, Trent Williams, was not on the field due to injury. This is less of a rare coincidence, but I still find it interesting that both teams were playing against red, white, and blue jerseys when the injuries happened.